you can get Califinale products from our official web store. Find any special offers on our website, social media and YouTube channel. On our store page, the cart is located in the top right corner. Click on checkout when you're ready to purchase. After accepting terms of purchase, choose your payment method. Enter your name, email, the buyer's country and payment details if you are paying by credit or debit card. You can also purchase any product as a gift for someone else. Don't forget to provide the recipient's name, email, delivery date and if you want, you can also attach a message. After you've completed payment, your product activation code will be sent to the email address you provided during purchase. You will receive free emails. A welcome email, an order confirmation email, and one containing an activation key and instructions on installation. If you already have a trial version of Color Finale 2 Pro installed, you can activate the full version automatically just by clicking on the activation code in the email or via License Manager. Otherwise, download the plugin and double-click to run the installer. Follow the installation steps and enter your name, email and the activation code you just received. Whenever there's a new version of the plugin that's out, you can update from the Color Finale app, which would have appeared in the Launchpad and Applications folder after installation. The app contains a plugin. Open the app and click the Check for Updates button. If a new version of the product is available, the installation will begin. Alternatively, you can always download the latest version for your Mac from the License Manager. Find your product activation key in the email you received after purchase. If you don't have the email up, head to colorfinale.com. Go to the support section at the bottom of the homepage. Once you've got it open, enter the email with which you used to purchase the product. You will receive an email with a temporary access link that will give you access to your license history and more. The access link expires after two hours, so if you need a fresh link, just enter your email again. You can check your Color Finale 2 registration details from inside Final Cut Pro. Click on the three dots in the top right corner of the Color Finale Inspector, then select Preferences. Under the License tab, you'll find basic information about the product, an Update License button and an option to deactivate the license if you need to. In case you encounter difficulties using the product, want to have a consultation or have any questions, please contact our support team. Send an email to support at colorfinale.com. We thoroughly investigate each individual case. It's important to note that when submitting a request, you must use the email associated with the purchase of the product. This is necessary for us to promptly help you with your issue. Also, please try to provide all relevant details. A brief description of the issue, your versions of macOS, Final Cut Pro, our product, and whether you're on Apple Silicon or on an Intel-based Mac. If you're doing client work or working on an important project, we strongly recommend to not rush into updating macOS and Final Cut Pro on the first day of update releases. Our advice is to disable automatic updates and wait for official communication from the Color Finale team. We often receive questions in the comments and support regarding the color picker not working from the inspector. Too often, users overlook that the effect is not actually selected. You first need to select the effect in the inspector so that there's a yellow border around it. This behavior isn't limited to Color Finale 2. Any effect that interacts with the image in the viewer needs to be selected first, even Final Cut Pro's native tools. So, as a rule of thumb, if anything doesn't show up in the viewer, keep the effect selected in the inspector panel. And that's it for this round of questions. If you have any more, please leave them in the comments. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.